me. Hello, this is Dr. Carmina Skeledon speaking. Is this the Dr. Skeledon that was just on the Magic School Bus show? Why, yes. What can I do for you? Well, I've been trying to reach the producer, but he's all tied up, and I have some probing questions about the dinosaur show I just saw. Dig away. First of all, everyone knows that nobody's ever seen a real live dinosaur. You're absolutely right. But we do see lots of fossils of the bones which make up their skeletons. Okay, so then how can you say which dinosaurs were herbivores and which were carnivores? Oh, that's easy! Fossil teeth! The plant eaters, you see, had flat grinding teeth, and the meat eaters had pointy cutting teeth. Well, thank you for calling. Goodbye. <laughs> Kids these days, they are just so inquisitive. Hello? Hi. I was wondering, if nobody's ever seen a real live dinosaur, then how could you possibly know that a Parasaurolophus made a noise like this? Oh, that's very good! And you are right! No one knows exactly how dinosaurs behave or what they sounded like. You see, we use our imaginations and make educated guesses. So all that stuff about the T-Rex not being so mean was another one of your educated guesses, right? Absolutely right. Thanks for calling. Wait a minute! So no one's ever traveled back in time and seen real dinosaurs? Absolutely not. Time travel is impossible. Even for Ms. Frizzle? Oh, <laughs> even for Ms. Frizzle. Thanks a lot, Doc. Ah, like it or not, I don't think even Ms. Frizzle could go back in time. Still, it would make a good field trip. If it were possible. Oh, but of course it's not. Thank you.